Hello guys. So you might think that the coolest part of the Falcon Heavy SpaceX launch was the fact that they managed to put a car in the space. But you know what I think was the coolest part? The two side boosters that they managed to detach and automatically land back on the launching site all by themselves. I think that was a fascinating piece of technology and as a matter of fact I have already been using this technology for, for, for the past five years on my drone. So we're going to talk about how exactly this technology works and how these drones manage to fly back to the launching pad and come back and land all by themselves. We have actually managed to kind of draw a simple launching pad over here and uh, we, we just drew this out and we will use this as our launching pad and uh, we are going to fly the Mavic today which we will try that it comes back and lands all by itself. These drones are already equipped with GPS but in addition to that they also have something called as the VPS which is the vision positioning system consisting of ultrasonic sensors and cameras. The ultrasonic sensors measure the distance between the aircraft and the ground by reflecting sound waves while the camera captures images of the ground below to remember positioning information. So every time your drone takes off, the downward facing vision sensors record the images and height information which is then paired with the satellite coordinates received from the GPS. So now your drone has two different positioning systems which significantly improves the positioning accuracy. And now it's time to put this in action. So I'll hit the auto takeoff button and allow it to hover at a predefined height and give it sufficient time to record the necessary information that it's going to require while landing autonomously. And then I'm going to fly it far away from me. So now that it's gone sufficiently far, I will trigger the return to home feature and wait for the drone to do the magic. And that is a pretty good landing. Of course, there's a little bit of shift from the original takeoff position, but considering the distance it flew from, I think that's a very impressive and accurate auto landing. So now you know how the SpaceX Falcon Heavy spacecrafts achieved this. A question to the audience. Can you think where else this technology could be useful? We have already managed to use this in rockets and drones, and I'm sure there could be many more areas where this technology could be deployed. Thank you and fly safe. Bella from from my school sings every morning. <laughs>